Okay, so there you can see we are up to 150 degrees Fahrenheit and 64 to 65 C um, Celsius and uh, yeah, so it isn't thermal throttling and the fan surprisingly isn't running so I think I might have forgot to plug the fan in. Um, even with the fan, this normally tops out about 62 to 63 degrees C, so nothing too major has changed. But what I want to do is I would like to take, well, not these, but this. So this one I originally bought, and of course it's too big. I mean, Christ, it's a, a, almost as big as the case. So I bought these, but sadly, I don't think they'll be big enough either. So I bought these to take my thermal paste and stick these down on the original heat sink. That way these will dissipate some more heat through the fins than the flat thing that's inside. So let me go ahead and shut this down and I'm gonna go ahead and stick some of these on. I'll show you in a minute. So first off, yes, I did forget the fan, but again, that doesn't change the temperature of this very much at all. Okay, so I went ahead and took some of my uh, heat sinks. They have seven fins and I broke up them in almost half, three fins and four fins. So I'm just going to place them where I can. So as you can see, this will be the arrangement that I put them in. And another one here. But I am also going to have a three pin here and a four pin here, right like that. So I'll be back once this is done. There is our finished product. I know it doesn't look anything fancy, but we should definitely see an improvement, especially up here with these actually wicking heat up, hopefully. Um, but in general, we should sh see a improvement across the board. And if I wanted to get, you know, more intricate, I could put more over here up here you know fill in the gaps but this is just a concept so that's uh, about as far as I'm willing to take it right now so let's hook it back up and I will show you what it looks like temperature wise right so there we go and it is time to start this test up once again all right I'll be back once this is done there we go. You can easily see that it did help a little bit, but not much. Now, I may go back through and get some thermal adhesive and go ahead and stick these down permanently because I don't see why I need to remove them, nor I don't want to leave them with just thermal paste and it uh, let go or whatever while it's in travel. So it will definitely be getting uh, thermally adhered. Um, but other than that, you can see that the temps are a little bit better, uh, four or five degrees better, uh, but nothing overly amazing. Uh, when I first started it, the temps were astonishing. Um, because before the temps kind of jumped up instantly, whereas this one stayed at 50 degrees until the last minute, and then it started to climb. So that means everything started saturating with heat. So it still did improve. Not much, but if you do own one of these little guys, it may be worth putting those two heat sinks at the end of the fan that might actually be the best uh, situation for it. Anyways, 
Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, hit that like button. And as always, you'll see me in the next one. Bye-bye.